Hello guys, it is February 10th, I believe, and um, I have a lot of stuff to do, it's already 2, so um, I gotta get going with all that stuff, but um, right now I'm looking for a donation drop-off center for clothes, because I have a bunch of clothes that I need to drop off, and um, yeah. I love when weird coincidences happen, like, um, I have no idea where to drop these clothes off or anything, so I asked my uncle, I was like, hey, do you know of a place, like Salvation Army or Goodwill or something, and he was like, actually, I was just about to go down there and drop some clothes off, I was like, that is really weird, so I'm taking his stuff too, so I have a huge drop off, um, and please don't fight about whether Salvation Army or Goodwill is good or bad for you in the comments, because it's going to just, like, it, it all does the same thing, okay? I don't really know exactly where it is. I just know that it's in this area down here. Um, so yeah, doing that. I need coffee because I haven't had coffee yet. Oh, it's already three. Oh my God, I thought it was two. So I need coffee and um, then I'm gonna go get a smog check on my car because it needs to be done really badly. I've procrastinated, whoa, I said that weird. I've procrastinated getting this done for a very long time and I've gotten two tickets for my tabs on my car which is really bad like I've already paid my registration for this year I just it hasn't been completed I guess because I need the smog check so I have to do that today um but I actually have to clean my car because it's really embarrassing how like just dirty it is so I'm gonna go vacuum it and then take it to the smog place thing I have less than two weeks before I leave and that stresses me the heck out because I have to, if my car does need work, for like brake pads or something, then I only have two weeks to do that. And I ha am working with Monica and Shelby and I have to pack and everything. And I don't even know how to pack. Like, I feel like I'm come, like I was when I was coming out here for the first time. Like, I don't know. How do you pack all of your stuff when you still have two weeks left? You know what I mean? My water bottle is making a weird noise. I don't know, like, how do you pack all of your stuff? Like, what do you wear? What do you use? Very, very tricky. Okay, so I'm at the place now, and um, the guy had just left. So I made an appointment for tomorrow at 1, and I'm going to go back there, obviously, tomorrow at 1. And now I'm going to go home and eat something because I'm really hungry. I got coffee and edit my video. country my sister gave me this like car tripod like last year i think it was for my birthday or something and i've tried to use it once like i think i just like kind of rushed trying to put it on and it didn't work like it just didn't stay so i'm gonna try right now because that would be so helpful that i don't have to hold the camera while i'm like driving so um i think that i might put it just like right here or something i don't really know Ugh. Okay, let me figure this out first. I got it to be like put together. Oh, it's out of focus, but it just like won't stick I don't know what to do. I think the suction thing just like doesn't work like I'm trying to do it It just falls. Yeah, there's there's no way that this is happening. Unfortunately, this would be so convenient I could just, I'm done playing with this, but I mean maybe I could find one that like Works and then that would be really cool. Especially for my road trip. Okay. I, that's a thing. I have to find one before my road trip Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna go in and make some food because I'm really hungry. And I just bought these huge strawberries yesterday. I'll show you them. They are absolutely ginormous. And that's probably what I will eat. That and some yogurt and granola. Okay, look how giant. Let me go into the light. Giant these strawberries are. Like, hand comparison. Like, that's so big. Anyways, I have some strawberries that I'm gonna cut up and some yogurt. This is... Um, just like honey Greek yogurt. It's really good. Um, and then I have some of these like, um, granola packets that have like raisins and just really good stuff in it. Yes, this is how you food. Um, these are the granola things that I just randomly picked up. They're the Cascadian Farms fruit and nut to go things. And I love Cascadian Farms granola. I used to get just the oat and honey one, like the big box. It was kind of, I think meant to be a cereal or something. Um, but then I saw these and I just like had to get them because I used to get the honey and honey Greek yogurt with granola and fruit from Starbucks. And it was like two bucks or $3 or something like that every morning. And I was like, why don't I just get a big thing of honey 
Greek yogurt and these things, which is literally the same exact stuff they put in the Starbucks stuff. And it'll last me way longer and it'll be a lot cheaper. So, so plans for tomorrow have changed a little bit. Um, I have my appointment to get my smog check done, which if you guys don't live in California, a smog check is basically just like a car inspection. Um, so I have my appointment at one. Oh God, someone else's video is playing. Um, I have my appointment at one and, um, I am going to actually go get my car painted and, um, I'm going to go in earlier, like before 12 for that to be done. So I'm thinking that I'm going to go to the smog place at like 8 a.m. when they open and, um, just be like, Hey, I have an appointment for later, but I can't make it. Will you do it right now? So hopefully that's a thing that will happen, but if not, then I'll just wait until I get my car back and I get my car back probably like Saturday. Um, and we have like an extra car here that I can use. It's like a big green Cadillac. I'll show it to you guys. Um, but, um, it was my grandfather's old car. So it's gonna be interesting driving that cause it's huge. So yeah, but I'm going to take a shower right now and, um, it's about, it's six and I'm going to edit my video that I need to edit for tomorrow. And yeah, and then probably make some dinner or something. I feel like all I've shown you guys today is food. Not really. I only have like yogurt, but I'm almost positive. I have like basil in my teeth, but I really want frozen yogurt and there's a golden spoon around the corner. So I think I'm going to go get some in a little bit. It's only like 730. Oh, it's eight. Um, but I'll probably go when I finish the fosters and that will be my motivation to edit my video. I promise. I'm making a quick pit stop into Target. I don't know if you guys can see me at all. Um, but yeah, I'm making a quick pit, pit stop to Target because I am looking for iron pills and I think that I have an iron deficiency or what people call like anemia. I think that's how you pronounce that. I don't really know. I've known a few people in my life that have had it. Um, but I have had this problem for a couple months where I'm just like, totally exhausted no matter like I could sleep for 12 hours and be doing nothing for three hours after I wake up and just be completely exhausted which is pretty much what I did today like I really didn't do that much and I've been awake for maybe six hours and I am exhausted like I can't even keep my eyes open so I was looking it up and I also get these really bad headaches if you guys have watched my vlogs for a while you know that I get bad headaches for no reason and TMI I have a really heavy blood flow on my period so I was looking it up and um, everything says that I have like I lose iron really easily I guess and it's very common for women so I'm gonna go look for some iron pills or something and I should probably go see a doctor but I don't have one out here so I'm gonna wait until I go get home to go see a doctor um, I don't even think I have a doctor anymore I haven't been to the doctor since I was like 17 which is really bad just like two years ago and I can't go back to that same one right because I'm 19 I can't go to a pediatrician because I'm 19 um, but yeah I gotta find a doctor and gotta get that checked out because it's just like it's so irritating I'm always so tired and yeah so I'm gonna go look for some iron pills. I don't really know what to get. So I'm just gonna kind of look around and we'll see what what there is. I don't, I don't really know. Okay, whoa, focus. Okay, anyways, I think these aren't like iron pills, but I think they're gonna help with my energy. Um, I can't really look anything up because I have no service in here, but this is just energy B12 and I've heard about it before and um, that it just like helps boost energy and stuff. So I'm gonna try these out and then go see a doctor or something. I don't really know. Okay, so normally I would never make my like frozen yogurt this crazy like candy wise. Normally, like my usual frozen yogurt is chocolate mixed with birthday cake fro frozen yogurt, um, strawberries, Captain Crunch, and chocolate chips. And that is my favorite thing ever to get. But I saw all this stuff and I was like, yeah. So I did get the chocolate and birthday cake froyo. I got brownie bites, a little bit of strawberries because I had a lot of strawberries today earlier. Um, what else? I have some chocolate chunks in there and some gummy worms. I don't really know. I was feeling the gummy worms. Um, but I'm going to eat this and edit my video. And then the rest of the night, it's just going to be boring. So I'll say goodnight to you guys right here. Tomorrow is a busy, hectic day that I'm not ready for. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow.
Okay, I know I said goodbye, but I just wanted to say one more thing. Um, I have not started editing yet, but I have been super obsessed with Ally Speed's vlogs lately. I used to sad love when she and Charles vlogged together. Um, but I love her vlogs, and I don't know why I didn't watch them before, but her and her boyfriend now is so freaking cute. Anyways, besides the point, um, I came up with a genius idea. Tori, my best friend, um, has always wanted to start a YouTube channel, but she's always, like, been scared, and, like, it is awkward at first starting, like, talking to a camera and stuff, and she always felt really awkward, so she's like, I can't do it, like, there's no way I could do it. So, I have an idea. When I move home, like, when we're closer together, we will see each other a lot. So, I was thinking that she has one of these cameras, and I have one of these cameras, so we will vlog our days together, and then I will put them to- or we'll vlog separately, and even when we're together, and I will put the clips together, kind of like- together like a vlog channel together if that makes sense um so she will kind of be joining this vlog channel and i think it'll make the vlogs 10 times more interesting she goes to college and i think it'll just be so much more fun to see her friends too to see what we do together and yeah and then it'll help her get like accustomed to the whole youtube thing and talking to a camera so that's what i had to say and she's totally down for it so it'll be fun i can't wait um but yeah <laughs>